fetuses that were electively terminated. Many of us do not realize the history of vaccines or even the recent medical um, and scientific research using aborted babies up to full term to further our field. Baby H.E.K., a girl, was born upon elective termination of pregnancy in 1973. Too, too much? Too much. <laughs> but All right. we love the subject matter, and we're okay. glad that you brought it. Uh, May I say my conclusion? How long will your conclusion be? It's not. It, look, it's right there. <laughs> Thank right. you so All much. Right. Now, if it's long, I can't see from here, but if it's long, I'm going to have to bring I'll the listen hammer for down you, again. And All I'll right. respect that. Christian healthcare workers have always been called to be different. Christians in general, we've been called to be different. As we grow in wisdom and the longer we are in this fallen world, we should feel less belonging. The realization comes that we are in temporary assignment as we were created with eternity in our hearts. There is chance, there is a chance the Christian healthcare community is being set aside and sifted for such a time as this. But this is the point, okay? Freedom of choice did not originate in America, but with creation. And this is our united front. We are a holy nation, united, no matter where our feet stand vaccination status, political party, race, culture. Thank you so much. You. Any questions from the committee? Seeing none, thank you very much for being here. All right, we have uh, 